All right, people, welcome back. More Daily Duel. So today is Friday. That means they were playing with Chimids. I, I twist the deck, so I was like, all right, uh, Magician Girls, you try Cardamize. Chimids, don't try Cardamize. So we're trying, we're switching that. Like I said, we got plenty of time. And by plenty of time, I mean our time is ticking. Like I said, the, the Daily Duel ends on November 2nd. So, yeah. I mean, I'm looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to it because it seems like the more I go with daily duels, especially when I'm, it's getting closer to the end, I start to figure out, I start to realize that like the flaws, the flaws are really glaring that, you know, it's like we can only play with decks that are on the lineup. And while once a month seems like it's really quick, I mean, with how quickly, you know, cards and decks come out, uh, we're limited on that. And, you know, I pretty much have to record every day or at least record ahead of time. Sometimes I'm just busy, or sometimes I don't feel like recording, and it's just like, too fucking bad, you record, so. Uh, so, this is the good one, so. I can go ahead and just switch this out, play Cruiser, then check out Cruiser for... I guess I could search for my boss monster, because I have Hunter, and Hunter, so. I think I want to get, um... What's it called? What's it called? King. King, because I play Cruiser, then play King, and then Cruiser will get me the search of Sphinx. Summon, uh, Hunt Master, attack... Nice Armadies effect from Cruiser, and uh, then if something threatens me, I can just go Master, pop the Cruiser, I mean, pop the King, summon the Sphinx from my hand, so, yeah, because that's what King Golem does, you can special someone Travel Master from your hand, yep, so King Golem's definitely great, 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 so, I, you know, it's just, uh, anyway, look at the title, I, am, am I a, uh, Mason Action, Def oh, wow, wow, so, you let me play a spell, and then you play anti-spell? Like, okay, I guess. That really slows me down. This That card's like the antithesis of this fucking deck. Like, <sighs> you fucking suck. <laughs> you fucking suck. I, I must say that. And then you just quit. Like, you play anti-spell, and then you just quit. Like, what? Like, you fucked me good, and you decide to quit. All right, we're going to do a bit of that back. Okay, well, I found a weird glitch on uh, YGO Pro. So, how, do I just duel with this in front of my face? Like, can I refresh? Can I cancel? Can I do anything? Like, no, nah, I'm just gonna, guess I just duel with this in front of my fucking face. Thanks, YGO. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> it's so funny that I had to keep it in. Like, that, that that's how hilarious this is. <sighs> anyway, this opening hand's actually not terrible. I got double terror for me. I got my two trap mid cards, so I could easily just tag out, tag out again to Sphinx, so. That play's actually pretty decent. So uh, yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't know what I'm looking at, but I'll try, I'll try, people. So we can go ahead and activate terraforming, which can get me definitely cruiser because I need that search. Then I can activate cruiser, normal summon, pitch draw, normal summon, pitch draw. You already know, and then gave me some light points, I guess, because that's I mean, cruiser is also one in the past. We already know. And then, uh, then go out into. Uh, Probably just tag out, try out now, right into, what's it called, so. Drew that, but I don't need the block golem. I think I'd rather hold on to the terraforming than I did a normal summon again. Uh, is it difficult to see people? Is it difficult to see? Because it's difficult for me to see as well. Kind of like looking under, like, so dumb. <laughs> uh, I don't need the cruiser, because the terraforming can grab me anything. So, then... Um, speaking of the terraform and grabbing me anything, I think I want to grab King's right King right now, and switch out King. Search for my Sphinx. Like you already know, it's all great. And I'm glad I got a little bit deeper in my deck. I got that sound strike. It looks like we're going against Pen something Pendulum. I mean, it looks like we're going against a whole list of people hosting. But uh, what it really looks like is uh, a Pendulum League deck. Anyway, uh, the reason why it's called M I A. M -I -A uh, okay, say, so can I like not get the battle phase button? Is because I am in the, currently in an education class. Sorry, surprise, surprise. Daniel's always in college. Except for December, which is nice, you know. I have to get one month off in December before I hop back into it in January. I'm almost done with all my education courses, then take my math courses, you already know. So, uh, with that, the current one I'm in, which is special education, <laughs> the one who has been missing in action is the damn professor. Have not heard from her, seen from her, nothing the entire fucking time I've been in this course. It's fucking ridiculous, you know. It is, it is just straight up ridiculous. I think I'm just going to set one. I'm just going to set one because, ah, uh, no, because if he wants to twin twist it, he'll just twin twist my field spell too. So that, that would just be gravy as well. It's just to get my field spell, especially in Tremens. God, I can't believe this. Like, what, yo, what is this? What is this? You know? 
So you're going to go ahead and eccentric. Okay. Yeah, you can't do anything about that. Uh, eccentric, go ahead and pop my song strike. God damn it. <laughs> yep. Kinda wanted that. Save myself from this nasty pendulum summon that I'm about to receive. Oh my god, he's got the wisdom eye too. Alright. Alright, here we go. Here we go. You already know. Ah, oh, the pendulum mechanic. It is so fucking fair. And by so fucking fair, I mean so broken. So broken. So, so broken. I guess that was my fault for putting the card that I really wanted in the middle. Generally, you pop the card, the, you know, the first set card. That was my fault. I probably should have set the strike over here. And then when you math put in the zone, I've been like, yeah, I'm fine. But now it's not looking too hot. I'm just going to go ahead and pop my set card anyway, so it really doesn't matter. I said, you already know. That's the fucking pendulum mechanic. You already know. <laughs> yep. So there's an odd eyes, and then an odd eyes, and then oaf, and then an odd eyes, and just ugh, look at that. Look at that. Wow. Wow. Look at that. Yep. No, nope, that's fine. So I, I knew you wouldn't pitch him unless you had some way of summoning these two back. So, and I really don't have anything to crack his pendulum skills or anything. I mean, I could summon my summon my master. Oh, so you're gonna use Utopia Beyond, drop everybody zero? That's fine. You're not going to be able to attack into them anyway, so I really don't care. Attack decoration. Go ahead and activate my effect. Tag out King Golem. No. For Cruiser. Cruiser, because then I can tag out Cruiser for something else, which is nice. For King Golem, activate my effect. And then go ahead and summon Sphinx, who will be bigger than anything you have. You want to attack into my, my Sphinx? I guess so. I guess so. Now I kind of want to tag out into something else. Like, I kind of want to tag out this into, like, uh... Cause this doesn't do anything, just gives me light points. I kind of want to tag out into, like... I really don't care, but the cruiser will give me a nice search. Oh, King Golem would be nice. Give me another kind of maybe the fact or fortress. So I'm going to attack and defend. Can't be destroyed. Tell me not just can't be destroyed. Card effect. This card's not guy. I can talk about Oh, never mind. It's just going to quit. Ah! Ah, man. You have the pendulum mechanic on your side. And you're the one to quit? All right. All right. Ah, uh, we'll get another door right back. All right, it's fixed. <laughs> but the professor, she has not been around the entire time in the class has gone. She really sent an introduction message. She's like, here's my number. You know, call her, text me whenever, you know. I sent her text, nothing. I called her, nothing. She's like, oh, you know, contact me through email. She didn't give me her damn email. So I, I'm not the only one to notice this too. Like that's the that's the big problem, you know. The students are starting to get wary. We're already in week three out of four. Uh, but we're starting to email each other, the students in the classroom, being like, hey, what's up? Anybody heard from her? Like, nope. Uh, one of the students even reported her to like the dean of the college, and just like, yeah, where the fuck is she? Like, you know, we paid good money for this shit. We paid, I paid. 1600 for this damn class. If you're a professor not be around, it's just, ugh, you know? Especially with how important this class is. Because for this class, we're supposed to observe a special education course. That's really difficult to get in. Like, let alone observe just a regular course. The special education course, when they don't do background checks, they don't contact the schools or anything. You're just on your own. Like, good fucking luck, you know? It's really difficult. You know, like this opening hand. Really difficult. Uh, I didn't really need, like, a field spill or something, like... Uh, terraforming cruiser. There's a couple of film spells, but I need film spell before I can really make use out of this opening hand. If I can get kings, that'd be great. King, kings would be great. <laughs> yeah, the best of filth I could ask for, but the block going slow. Like, we're actually playing uh, some cockamaras in here. You, you, you wouldn't know because we haven't seen them, but they're actually in here. So, some of the gadget, some of the gadget, detach case search. You already know. If I would have went first, I probably would have striked that. You know, you get these out of the way so they don't float and you don't get the search. It's just a nice little neg. You know, nice little neg. But, uh, you know, I, so I'm having a hard time getting especially, and it's worth 30% of your grade. 30%. So that means that if I don't get this done, the best I can get is, I say the best I can get is D because I don't have 100% on everything because there was a quiz and I got. I missed one of the questions, so I only got four out of five, which means that the highest I can get is at 69%, <laughs> but that's a D. So I was trying to contact her and be like, is there some kind of substitute or something? I'm having a really difficult time, but wow. All right, well, I don't have a full spell. Like, like this is probably the worst opening hand I got. Like, 
Strength does nothing. I got two hunters that don't know anything. Like, uh, the one time I need souls, but we run like what? Three of that, three of that, two of that. It's eight, and the three terrifying. There's like 11 different spell spells up in this bitch. You can't draw none of them. Like, you don't draw a, a fucking spell spell in your opening hand, you ain't doing shit. I can't even do the double summon because I need a spell spell. Now, if a spell spell says I'm filled, then I get that additional moment summon so then I can go in like a guardian guardian. But if I'm a spell spell, I can't do shit, you know? I cannot do shit. So I, I have no idea. I can like set the hunter and then block myself, maybe. Maybe block myself, but it's not looking too hot for good old Daniel here. Cause at least the bot golem can eventually summon these two back from the graveyard. And then cross my fingers by then I have a filth spell, but I'm probably gonna be dead. Because you already know how aggressive gadgets are, and then he's detaching, getting a search every turn. Like, I really want to kill this fucker before he, you know, detaches twice and gets that search twice. But, what am I going to do, right? <laughs> what am I going to do? Don't want to strike that. That'd be terrible. You still get that photo effect. It's still destroyed by card effect. Even though I negated the search effect, it would still resolve in the graveyard to get that additional summon of the gadget. So, oh, and it's ABCs too? Oh, alright. <laughs> Never mind, it's APCs. Now since not since it's APCs, this is even worse. Like I thought maybe it was just gadgets or something. Well, I mean why did anybody play gold and silver gadgets for not playing ABCs, right? You gotta play the top tier shit. You gotta play top tier shit, people. Ugh. God damn it. <laughs> why do I have to open up like just ass? Like all I needed was one filled spell. If I had one filled spell, this hand would be actually be pretty good. Like I could actually do something with this opening hand. Like eleven different filled spells, get none of them. Like, any of them would have been fine because I could just switch it out. You know, and the end result would have been a nice, powerful Sphinx. That'd been awesome, but now it's just, uh... Are you gonna exceed these two into something? Another gear guy attacks? Get more detaches? Get more searches? No, I'm gonna catch the Twin Twister. I'm gonna catch the Twin Twister. You're gonna neg just so I can catch that Twin Twister. So, if the file is thinking about stopping you, wow, you're gonna pop your own shit. You're gonna go super neg. Did, nigga, did you just pop your own vanities? Alright, alright. Nigga don't even care. He's gonna win this dude. He's bad, and he's gonna win, like, sure. Sure. Okay. Why'd you pop your own shit? Mm-hmm. Wow. All right. All right. You're bad, and I'm still gonna lose because I opened up my ass. You opened up the tits, and it's ABC. It's top tier shit. You already know. No. So that's ABC Bus Dragon right there. There's A. There's B. All he needs is C. So, hopefully I can draw into a filled spell? Like, if I don't draw into a filled spell, I'm just gonna go ahead and scoop. Like, clearly. Clearly I'm gonna go ahead and scoop. <laughs> wow. Some people, you know, just all the luck. Like, why does he get his terraforming? Where's my terraforming? I need the terraforming, not him. He doesn't need any more ABC shit. Yeah, I mean, you kill one of my fucking traumas, so I can go ahead and summon. Yeah, fuck it, Jinx, come on. I forgot you could do that. I really did. I was like, I can't even summon Sphinx. Like, yeah, you can. So he's a nice 25 body. That's nice to have. So I know you have B in your hand. I know you can't summon ABC right now. I can kill that Tsukiyomi. Wow, still don't get a fucking... Still don't get a fucking, uh, fill spell. Alright. Alright, I think it's I think it's still best just to summon Overload. Oh, summon Overload. But he could just run it over, but... Fuck it, at least he has to just go in the battle phase. Although, you're the one that's when a monster is summoned, right? I wonder if he'll just go into the battle phase and run my ass over? I mean, I got called hunted, so that's nice. I think I'll just run over your Tsukiyomi. Uh, my fucking Sphinx has never looked more naked when he has absolutely no fucking... no fucking feel spells to see. So, I know he has B... One card in hand, I don't know, and I'm drawing into another random card. I think it's best if I just summon the Overlord. Is that the Call of the Haunted? So even if he just entered battle, runs over my Overlord, I can just, during your, you know, and your battle phase, Call of the Haunted, summon back the Overlord, because I think you're going to summon B, B to try to cook C, but you're never going to get summoned, you know? Um, uh, it, it, like, really? Why is it question mark, question mark, question mark, question mark, question mark, question mark? Like, seriously? Like, seriously? Like, this is fucking Quacky Mirrors. Like, we, we should know this shit. <sighs> At least this is nice, because there is a filth spell on the field. Not my filth spell, anyway, but there's a filth spell on the field, so I can't get the additional normal summon of a rock monster, so that's cool. Now, I'm kind of wondering if you're going to be smart or dumb. 
Because if you're smart, you'll just enter battle and run over my overload. But if you're dumb, you'll try to summon and then run into my overload. So I'm glad to actually see him. Like, seriously, question marks? So, trying to figure out, I, I tried to contact some people through my high school. Oh, never mind. Never mind. He has C anyway. What's wrong with you? 12? You say that's okay because then you'll go to the graveyard and you'll, st and you'll still do your thing anyway. I would love to stop you. I would love to just stop you, but the problem is, is that you just go to the graveyard anyway. But then if I don't stop you, you can just equip with the union hanger. So, uh, fucking ABCs. Why am I facing this top tier shit, boys? Like... You can die so you don't equip, and then hopefully, you when you just go into ABC, it can stop you. Like, you don't seem very bright, because I think you should have just went into battle phase and attacked me. Yeah, you don't seem very bright. Yeah, I'm just gonna fuck you up again. Like, that was, that was, that was kind of dumb. You should have just went straight into battle phase and came after my ass. But instead, you were just like, oh, fuck it. ABC, ABC again. And so, you could just not get summoned. <laughs> like, for a guy who opened up pretty good, pretty good, you still got a B in your hand, too. Like... That's not great. Still not drawing into a field spell, so that's that's awesome. Oh, I can do Bot Golem. Block Golem contributes out because there's only Earth monsters in my graveyard. Summon those two. Summon back those two. And then I can just like a normal summon and then go into Gorgonic Guardian. That would not be terrible. No, because I already normal summon. I already normal summon the Block Golem. I guess I could try my Hunter and do that, but I just... I'll just do this. Not the greatest opening hand, not at all, not at all. <laughs> I cannot activate my effects this turn. So I'm gonna summon them three and a four. Can't go into Gorgonic Guardian, but getting that uh getting that overload back would be fantastic. Cause uh, I know that he has in his hand and know he has a, a B. So he could just summon B and I could be like, nope. So as long as I keep him from summoning monsters, he can't keep on equipping with his, you know, getting that additional equip. As long as that set card's not like a Solemn Strike or anything, which knowing my luck it might be. <laughs> Cause he drew and played the C. Cause I remember him searching for the B. Ugh. <laughs> like that top tier shit, boys, it's just so difficult to deal with, that top tier shit. <laughs> and then this is like the worst opening hand I could have asked for with Trauma. It's like Trauma is a no fill spell? Like come on. Fuck me, you know? Fuck me. <laughs> And and not and no fill self turns on turns on turns like maybe one turn okay but it's it's turn six and I still have not seen a single fill spell he's seen this fill spell quicker than I've seen mine and I run fucking eleven fill spells like come on come on come on waiting on you sir if you got a solemn strike strike it man if you got a solemn strike strike it there you go took you long enough of course you get the warning too like come on yep so I guess I'll just enter battle and run over your uh your giant. So I know you have a B in your hand, so you can go B and equip like an A and get, you know, your set your shit set up for another ABC Buster Dragon. Great. No, I'm not you'll probably just draw into like a Poton Thrasher or something to make a rank 4 play and handle my fucking Tremit Sphinx with ease. That would be my luck, though. More Silver Gadget, Gold Gadget shenanigans. You still got, look like you still got one more Silver Gadget if you play 2-2. Two and two. So, th this is bad. This is bad. Like, I'm gonna try. I contacted, and they were like, oh, yeah, sure. I don't mind. Someone, one of the teachers, special education from my high school, is like, you can observe, but you gotta contact my supervisor. Hopefully, when I contact the supervisor, it'll be like, it's fine instead of just, you know, we'll get the call, call with to contact our school because I don't have time to do that. I literally have one week left. Like, so I, I might just be shit out of luck. Like, I'm getting so upset about this shit. So retarded. Like, I wish I could just ask the, the, the teacher for a sub, you know, a substitution. Oh, and of course, this card is sent from the field to Gray. You can add a Union Monster from your deck to your hand. So, he's probably going to bust out ABC Buster Dragon, and I don't have anything to handle that right now. Oh, no, he scooped. How do you scoop? Like, nigga, all you literally had to do was just wait for this to go. This would search you. This would... If this card is sent from the field guy, you could add a Union Monster from your deck to your hand. I guess you could add back the B. B would get you a search and get for C. There's ABC right there. Like, come on. You're playing top tier shit. And he shouldn't be scooping a Traumans with no fucking field spell. Get our dual bear back. Whew. I, I don't even know how I won that. Like, that was just 
that was just perforation. Just the fact that uh, that uh, Trimid Hunter can still, I mean, the Sphinx could be summoned just by me dying, dying by battle is nice. Got a full spell. That's cool. I should have went first. I don't know why I chose second. I was like, nah, I don't care. Is it blue eyes? Oh, it's Felgram. Is it the old Felgram? <laughs> okay. Oh, it is blue eyes. Thought so. Duh. Duh. Gotta play that top tier shit. You play ABC's blue, blue eyes. You already know. You already know. <sighs> yeah, I didn't get the best fills, but I got the worst fills, but fucking Fortress is the worst one. Oh, uh, I mean, I could do plays, but what does Fortress, what does this do? I get to add one back from my graveyard to my hand. So really, I just need to figure out a way out and send Art Party of you up. So I'm definitely going to be facing down Belize or Felgren next turn. I'm not going to be able to get over that. I'm not going to be able to get over that. So best thing I could do is activate Fortress, then I wish, you know, I wish I had Cruiser right now. Cruiser would be so much better than Fortress. Fortress is the worst one. Fortress is the only Fills by the way in the tool. The rest are in the other two, three. Oh, and then fucking pulls. Like, alright. Shit. So, uh, I can activate Fortress. Then Fortress can summon me, summon me. I'm, I'm also really scared of attacking the set card. I probably won't do it. I probably won't attack the set card. Because the set card could be a fear. I mean, the fucking Engine Whitestone. Engine Whitestone will summon his fucking Kai, which would banish my fill spell. Or one of my set cards, anything. So, I'll just allow him to do it. If he wants to flip summon and, you know, go for a Sync 8, then I don't care. So... Uh, activate Fortress, which will do, like, nothing, so, yay. Then I can tag out into Cruiser, and then I can tag out into... I can tag out into Cruiser, and then Cruiser tag out into something else, add me Sphinx, you kill him a monster, so it's Sphinx, so... That's, like, the best plan right now. Probably end up with, uh... King or something like that, like... <sighs> that is really all I have to say about this opening hand, it's just... Uh, I said I could go into Garden Guardian, Guardian, but I don't even think that's smart either. Like, I think that this might be the best plan, and if he somehow, some way, has Twin Twister, then fuck me anyway. Like, really, really, me anyway. <laughs> even if you target my failed spell, then you know I'll be okay. Remember, Finks, as long as you just kill him, so. Alright, so go ahead and summon Paladin, and Paladin can equip that uh, Arc Brave again. Be nice if you said that my charming monsters can't be targeted, but there's nothing like that. Like my charming monsters are not anything, so uh, you're gonna be doing a couple of field spell tag outs. We're gonna pop fortress, get cruiser, pop cruiser, get king. I guess yeah, that's fine. Yeah, see, told you it was a fucking ancient white stone. I told you. I'm like man, fuck that. It was, it was ancient last time. What's the point of killing it? You know, they get into a fucking glass spirit or whatever. Fucking, fucking warning that. And that top tier shit, my boys. Top tier shit. So he's definitely going to come and kill one of my charmants, which is fine because I can just go ahead and add Sphinx. Dancer, go ahead in my fortress, and switch it out for cruiser, and then hunter, attack the cushion, hunter, switch out for strings. Come on, come on, attack me, fuck boy. Attack me, I'm about to drop my fucking boss monster in your ass. Problem is that fucking brave can easily still fuck me up, so. Yeah, come at me, boy. So, tag that out for King. Ah, now I'm stronger than you. Ah, I didn't even think of that. I didn't even think of that. I'm like, shit. Shield wasn't changed. Run right into me, boy. Problem is, this will still go off, and that can summon Felgrand and fuck with me, so the pulse doesn't do anything. No, that is nothing. So definitely I'm gonna get that spirit and definitely I'm gonna get that felt like, I'm I, I, I did the, the the right correct plates but because he's running that top tier shit you know great deck I'm still probably gonna get it so uh, 
I mean, if I want to, I can activate Pulse, and Pulse can, you know, do those two to pop the fucking Spirit, but I think Spirit's probably gonna get me. Yeah. Go ahead and get rid of my Field Spell. Yep, yep, yep. Said there's really no po point in doing pulse right now. Yep. That's sad that because he's playing that top tier shit, blue eyes, I'm still in some shit. Uh huh. And he still has cards in his hand. Like, like I'm not out of the woods yet. Not even. I beat ABCs. Maybe I could beat blue eyes. I don't know. I'm kind of slow. I'm not that great. We'll try. gonna banish my master. Ah, I guess that's fine. I mean, I have another king's golem, so. I'm just so slow in comparison to him, you know? You able to do plays during my turn, doing plays during his turn, bust out strong monsters. I kinda only just play during his turn. You know? Nope. I mean, I'll, I'll have plenty of different field spells, so I can at least say that. I said I could pulse, but I just don't see the point right now. Like, I guess I could pulse and pop one of his eights, but I think it'd be better if he tries to go into a rank eight play and I pop him then. And if not, when he enters battle, I could just, you know, tag out for Sphinx, who should be plenty strong. Plenty strong. Like, this, 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 this is not my goal to win. Ah, uh, Yu-Gi-Oh, right? It is. It's just some decks are just way stronger than others. Way stronger. Charmades are just kind of crappy. They really are. They're just kind of slow. They need more cards. They need a lot more cards. Like more better monsters. Like their monsters are just kind of slow and shitty. Is that another brave? Yeah, well, we should have one more still in your deck. You playing during my turn is just kind of sucking right now. Or send an ancient stone. Whatever one, I mean, it's all good. You, you just get summons. You get summons. Send another Felgrand. Okay. Gospel. So it, it, it's about Gospel O'Clock, I'd say. It's about Gospel O'Clock. Go ahead. Gospel. Gospel. Go ahead. Go ahead and Gospel. I know you got it. I know you have it. <laughs> and that would be a real struggle. And playing gospel would just be make this thing just go way downhill. They could just summon that fell grand and banish me. And, ugh. Uh, he has another ancient white stone. Like, come on, man. Uh, why is this duel so difficult? Why does he have everything? <laughs> Great, so like Ancient White Stone is probably the most broken blue eyes card that they have. Like alternative's not even that bad. Like alternative is strong. I'm gonna say that. Alternative's pretty strong. But I wouldn't give it just, you know, like oh my god, hit that shit. Like stone and melody. Because melody, I mean that's a one card off fucking alternative. And ancient stone, like its sync effect is good. I mean it's a tuner, its graveyard effect is good, its grab back effect is good, like fucking ancient white stone is just stupid. Uh so I can pop you get cruiser and King Golden Fed. Special summon Sphinx. Oh, you can negate that. I forgot you can negate any card in the graveyard. Oh, but you're not? Uh, is it just monsters? No, it's, it's card. It's card. It's card. So now you can only attack my Sphinx. Not that you can't handle my Sphinx. I'll say, if you have Honest, I will fucking eat my hat. Okay. Okay, so this is tagging out for probably like Moonlight or something, I'm guessing. I mean, I have my Pulse, so I can pop whatever he summons. Is he just gonna summon? Yeah, I thought he was just gonna summon me. Okay, so you're just gonna bounce me back to the hand. I mean, you're gonna die during the end phase, so I really don't care. I 
Oh, I don't really care. That's fine. I'll go back to the hand because if you attack me, I'm just gonna come out anyway. No. You could die. I'll take that. I forgot you had that effect. I probably shouldn't have let you kill me then. I forgot that you had an additional killing effect. Alright, oh, that's great. And some Ned Arc right back. Shit. So you can banish my felt spell. Awesome. I guess I can get a search before that happens. And you know what's the sad thing is? He's still gonna get an Ancient White still during the end phase. Like, this shit's not even near me. We were just going back and forth and back and forth. And I'm trying to keep up, but I can't. I can't. I forgot that Svelgren had that effect, so. An Arc Brave can go off and wipe me before I can even chain my master. Like, alright. Before I can even chain my master, it was already done. Like, okay. I mean, I still could have chained my master and master tag out a full spell. You can banish another different one, but I kind of want this search, but nope. Didn't even ask me. Didn't even ask me. Guess maybe because it's during the damage step? I think it's because it's during the damage step. So, this will die. And then you will go ahead and summon with your ancient white stone, so. So you're still good. You're still good. You're still good. Unless you time out right now, because your bar is getting kind of full. No, that's fine. Yep, yep, you timed out. Yay, I won! I beat top tier index. Yeah. <laughs> so next turn, I mean, he was summoned to Blizzard or whatever. I mean, if he summoned his another card, I could just activate this, you know, use my effect, put two back, pop one of them. Because this was going to die, pop that, run over that. He still had two cards in his hand. And maybe I would have drunk some felt spot. I don't know. That was a tough one. That was a tough one. All oh, these are a little tough. So, anyway, like I said, I give up the press there. I'm hoping that they'll allow me to do this observation. I'm just pretty much trying to get everything done and do absolutely done. So, if by some chance that the lady's still alive, everything will be there so I can keep my A. Because I'm trying to keep my GPA up in college, of course. But, you know, this course, just, just that. I've, I've literally done everything else except for the quiz. Like I said, I missed one of the questions. So instead of getting five points, I got four points. But, I mean, that's still, that would still be 99% of the class if I, you know, get everything else right. I mean, I still got many more quizzes. Got two more quizzes. Yeah, week three quiz, week four quiz. But they're, they're, they're relatively easy to get the answer. So I just messed up on one. Um, and I said I should be able to. And the curve is the class of stupid. It's like 100% to 95 no, 100% to 96, that's an A. But 95 to 90, that's an A minus. Like, what the fuck? 95 is an A minus? Fuck me, you know? So, the class is really just difficult for the curve, and the professor's not there, and she's gonna get reported, and it's just, I'm trying, I'm trying, people, I'm trying, you know? <sighs> you know. Anyway, we're done here, so. I tried, I tried, but if I think ABC and Blue Eyes, it's just, duh, you know? It's that top tier shit, boy, and summoning 3,000 beaters, and, you know, I'll be still seeing your opponent. That's just nothing to scoff at. And I'm slow as fuck. <laughs> anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Daily Duels. Thanks for watching. Thanks for that support. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Actually, the last stream is going on. I know we haven't had a last stream in the last two weeks. But no, there is not originals I am going to. There's going to be originals in November I'm going to. That's a cool minute from now. So, uh, actually, by then, I should be on my break. So, you don't have to worry about that. Anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Thanks for that support. And, uh, yeah, see you guys tomorrow at the live stream. If you can make it. Thanks for watching.